The United States Justice Department is reviewing potentially classified documents found at President Joe Biden's former office. Biden's special counsel say that around 10 such documents were found at the Penn Biden Center back in November and were immediately handed over to the National Archives. Biden kept an office at the think tank, which is about a mile from the White House from 2017 to 2020. The story was first reported by American broadcaster CBS News. Special counsel Richard Sauba says that the documents in question were discovered late last year while clearing out the office space and adds that the White House is cooperating with the Department of Justice and the National Archives. Quoting sources, CBS reports that none of the documents included American nuclear secrets. U.S. Attorney General Merrick Garland has assigned the Chicago attorney to review the documents. Apart from this, the FBI has also launched an investigation into the documents recovered. Republicans and pro-Trump leaders have slammed the FBI and the DOJ of being biased towards the Democrats. Remember, back in August 2022, authorities searched ex-President Donald Trump's residence at Mar-a-Lago. The raids came after Trump failed to respond to repeated requests for cooperation on retrieving documents taken from the White House after his term. Reacting to the news, former President Trump wrote on his social media platform, Truth Social, and I'm quoting him, When is the FBI going to raid the many homes of Joe Biden, perhaps even the White House? These documents were definitely not declassified, end of quote. While Republican leader from Texas, Ronnie Jackson, tweeted, quote, Where is the FBI? Where is the dramatic raid? We have two systems of justice in this country, one for them and one for us. End of quote. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.